Hi video professionals, this is Troy coming to you from the heart of the web video universe. Telestream episode or Sorensen Squeeze? It's the question every online video professional has to answer at one time or another. To help you make the call, I spoke with Derek Freeman, a trainer at Genius DV in Orlando, Florida. Here's a little bit of what he told me about both programs. One of Sorensen Squeeze's best features is that you can capture video directly to it if you have a video deck attached to your computer. See the Capture Video icon here. You can also set up watch folders so that Sorensen can automatically detect if there's a new video that needs encoding. Beginning users will appreciate the many presets that come with Sorensen. Go over to this box and click the Disclose Triangle by the encoding format of your choice to see the whole list. When you're done, you can automatically FTP your work up to your server. Best of all, Sorensen is very, very stable, so you don't need to worry about it crashing. We can't show one of the best things about Telestream episode, that it's very fast when encoding your files. It's pretty much lightning fast encoding, our expert said. You might like the ability to bookmark your source folders, or that this Mac-only program includes special settings for, wait for it, Apple devices, so that you can get your video looking great on an Apple TV, iPhone, or iPod video. Other helpful extras include the ability to automatically tack on bumpers or trailers, or to send your finished file to your streaming server. So in the end, it really comes down to what features are important to you and how you plan to use the program. That's all for this week. Please join me every day at webvideouniverse.com for more tips and tricks. Until next time, happy shooting.